Brisbane Yamaha knows boats. Hi, I'm Aaron, the owner of Brisbane Yamaha, and today we've got your yellow fin 7000 hard top. Now I can tell you, hard top, hardcore boat. And for those people that are looking for a custom plate boat, those people that want to go up north, those people that want a boat where you could do anything, have a look at this. 6 mil 5083 alloy bottom. That's right, hard as rock, 6 mil. That is unbelievable. Now Dan, before we get to the front, come and have a look at this. Because the ribs, this is a section out of the bottom of a yellow fin. Longitudinal ribs, five mil ribs in it, gussets, right? These things are unbelievably strong. Build a strong, show this, Dan, right? Have a look at how all the yellow fins are built. Now you would think that a lot of boats are made like that. You would think a lot of custom boats are made like it. They're not. This is built as strong as any of the finest alloy custom boats you could buy. The only difference is it's made better because it's made with the state-of-the-art machinery. Intel Waters Factory, the biggest aluminium boat builder in the Southern Hemisphere. And that should give you some peace of mind because these are made with planes. These are made with R&D department, not in some backyard. Now, have a look at this. We've got the alloy trailer, Quintrax's best trailer. Obviously, it's got a breakaway system because a boat of this size is gonna be over two ton. We've got the catch and release on the front. You know, beautiful for single-handed boating, just to get it on and off and watch one of the YouTubes, we've done it. Now this boat's painted in a two-tone blue, top and bottom. Look at this, there's even little structures, like non-slip as you walk around this cab. It's a massive cab inside and we're gonna see it in a minute. But non-slip for those people that want to work around. Now Dan's going to zoom in on the specs of the yellow fin range because you're going to be surprised what value and what quality goes into one of these boats. Tellwater have put years and years and years into R&D to make what they think is the best plate blue water offshore boat that's available in Australia. And I'm gonna tell you, I went in a 650 the other day and you can have a look at that YouTube. This thing is a beast, just like the 650. They ride fantastic in big water. Come around the back here, cause this is where a lot of the action happens. You know, trim tabs, because all boats are this size. And don't forget this is a seven meter boat. Seven meter boat. You know, self-draining, fully, fully welded floors. It has trim tabs, big sounder on the back, big transducer, live bait tanks, kill tanks. We put a 200 Yamaha. Now a 200 Yamaha are just a machine. You know, you just can't go past Yamaha. They'll get you out there, get you back, use no fuel. You'll get the best resale you can. Uh, anything with a Yamaha is the top of the tree. I'm telling you, it's just true. Go and have a look at resale. If you buy a Quintrex with a Yamaha, you get top dollar. You buy a yellow film with a Yamaha, top dollar. Everyone loves them. You know, of course, of course there's hydraulic steering and plenty of bits on the back where you could put some other transducers, you could put a burly bucket on the back. Now let's hop inside here. Now have a look up here, Dan. What we've done is put concealed side mount, binnacle on that, just to make it look sexy. There's your trim gauge. Here's a massive Simrad sounder that's gone in 12 inch. A beautiful thing, I'm not gonna open it. You've got the 6YC single gauge up here, Yamaha, finest you can get. Hydraulic steering. Look at the ergonomics. You've got seat slides on here. Plenty of storage with tackle. You know, have a look at these boxes here. What, you could just stuff those full. You never have enough room in a boat. That plastic tubing on the floor. Now we do that. It just makes it easier and softer on your feet. Look at this cabin, Dan. Have a look up here, because we're going in the water in a minute, and I know that's what everyone wants. You know, you get in the back, the fuses are easy to get to. Look at that, have a look at this. Look at that, look what we do here. We put a bit of, we put a bit of uh, lighting in these, just to show around, you know, LED lighting, it's get romantic in here, just a little toggle switch here. We've got an LED, we've got a, a USB plug, plus we've got the glove box in the back, here. You know, that's where you can hide all your valuables, put your, put your keys to the car, there's plenty of room in here. I could sleep in here. 
No, number six, four. Seat slides on both seats, and they're high quality seats. Look at that. Your mates could hold on to here on the back. Have a look here too, Dan. This is interesting. For those people, it's all right for me, I can reach. But let's say one of my kids want to get a rod. And I say, get it, if you can fish it, you get it. Well, you just pull that plane that comes down and now you can get your rod out. You know, the standard feature. Have a look at this. Brisbane Yamaha, we put these on because we've got that legendary trim shop. So we put these side winds that just stop a lot of the spray if there is. We've got the hard top with the windscreen, solid glass windows, tempered. Look at it, you're in here, you've got plenty of room and it's still a walk around. Now let's come back to the back. So we've got the seat that comes out. We've got a big kill tank in there, right? Put all your fish, let them bleed out before you put them into your esky. And there's your batteries, dual batteries. Live bait tank here, right? With a window that you can see because that's what you want. Massive live bait tank. You get, you put big mullet, you geez. You'd almost get a couple of bonito in there if you were chasing billfish. Look at this. Have a look at that bait board. Just standard bait board. You know, people think these are for drinks, that's for your sinkers. I put my rod in here, I put my sinker in there and I can put a bait on. You know, you can cut off here, your bait comes back. When you're moving around, the bait comes back into here. You can put rods, you've got enough room. Two, four, five. You've got 10 rod holders, plus three up either side. You've got 16 rod holders. I think we're a couple short, you know? But the 16 rod holders, standard. And why this boat is so good standard is because the amount of R&D has gone into it. And that R&D is going to really show in a minute when we put it on the water. Let's go in the water and see what this baby does. Here we are in a 7,000 yellowfin. It's a shocking day. It's blowing a gale. The seagulls can hardly stay in the air. But this is probably when you want to see what a seven metre hardcore plate boat does. Because that's what this is about. This is about you go fishing in the morning, it's clear, and it blows up nasty. Now the seas could be a lot bigger. It's a terrible day. But let's see how this little baby goes. Because I think it say, I think it's a game changer, these things. Not only are they the best value, they're one of the best riding plate boats in Australia. Now, if you don't believe me, you call the team and come out. Under 90 grand, 85 grand you can have this boat from, with a 200 Yamaha with all the fruit. Now that's incredible value because it's made by Tellwater and it's got a Yamaha and it comes from Brisbane Yamaha. Let's not talk, let's go and see what it does. Into that wave for the wind, and then I'll just pop it up, bring it up on top of that wave, and now it's just slicing through and doing it. Now we're sitting down, and this is pretty bloody easy going. Now, I'll slow it up, gee, it goes fast this boat. Basically it'll do 75. At 75, you'll be sucking in about 68 litres an hour. Now that's not bad going for a 200 when you're going that speed. Now let's just get that sitting nice. And I can tell you, in a day like today, we were going fishing out off the banks or going deep tempest, you got your mates all hanging on in there. This boat, not only is soft, is incredibly safe. You know, the longitudinal stringers, how this is made. It's built like a tank, six mil, 5083. How's that drone going, Dan? Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it, because they could do this all day. I'd have to taste mania in this thing. Fair dinkum, look at it. Beautiful. And with the hard top, it's raining. Let's hope we don't stuff that drone. We've got young Nick in the back. Nick's the talented mechanic I've got. Drone's catching up. This thing's a speed demon. You know, it's built. If you were thinking about buying a bar crusher, a Formosa, or a, you know, one of the custom, one of the millions of custom plate boats out there, you know, go and see the factory. Go and ask for, have a look at the plans. Hold on, I'll just put the windscreen wiper on because it's raining out there. I'll put the windscreen wiper on and the glass windows. You know, in the cabin, I'm warm. I can look out the window and wave. This thing's, this is a great boat, you know? But you know, go and have a look at a hardcore plate boat, as they say, and say, can I see the plans, please? You'll get the shock of your life how they do it. 
None like this. You know, everything's the same. So look at that. Can you see that, Dan? Look at that. And although I hardly have to worry about trim, you know, I'll trim it up a little bit. Gee, I tell you what. Okay, I'm going in. No problem. She doesn't want to breach. Just wants to bang into that, and I'm going three quarter onto the wave. Now that's that's good. It's rocking and rolling. It's not falling on its side. Now a lot of plate boats, you come up, and every now and again, it'll fall on its side and bang your back teeth out. Send a jar up your back, up your spine. You know, especially when you get old and rooted like I am. Now look at this. Bam! Straight over that. It's soft. We're not even standing up. And I'm going across the wave just to show you what it's like because it eats it when you go in and when you're just going at 90 degrees. <coughs> now I'll, I'll stop it up. We can't. Nick's sitting in the back, he's not even wet. You can put your mum in the back, take her fishing with you. She can make a couple of ham and pickle sandwiches for everyone and off we'd go. Now, can you see us, Dan? Let's have a look. So I'll turn into the wave. Then what I'm doing, I'm only going to go slow. So doing 34 so we're already doing over 30 kilometers an hour and what I do there then you have to just tweak the the trim tabs on them right and that's a part of the trade-off of having such a knife edge 19 degree dead rise is that you know you need trim tabs nothing wrong with that that's not a bad thing they come standard with trim tabs and look at that once you set it it just falls down and slices through that wave now, hopefully that drone can see, and what I'm going to do is just come up to this wave and commit, and that power of the 200 <coughs> just roars it on, and we just slice through. Here's a big wave. Now, if you're in some other plate boat, I tell you, that would have banged. Your mates would have held on. Some of your mum would have said, hold on, this is crazy, but they done it. Soft, dry, and fast, and with a Yamaha, incredibly reliable. Now, basically, if you're looking for a plate boat, if you're looking to fish out by, if you want to take a boat on an adventure, you should do yourself a favour, have a look at a yellowfin range. Brisbane Yamaha, we specialise in them. We've got the whole range ready to go. And if you want to come on the water, you know, if you're thinking about buying another boat, do yourself a favour. No obligation, water test. Come out and compare it. You know, we're not going to take you in the Logan River we're in the broad water. We're going to take you out here in the bay, take you out in the open ocean, where you can smash it out what you're really doing. God, if you want to give me a good fish, your fishing spot, let's go fishing with you. You know, bam, look at that, straight over all that. That is a wonderful thing. If you want to put yourself in the picture, get yourself a yellow fin, why don't you call the team at Brisbane Yamaha? I've got the best salesmen in the business. They're fantastic. There's five of them. You know, I've got women. If you want to talk to a woman, talk to Claire. She knows everything about boats and finance and, <coughs> and Quintrex and Yellowfin and Yamaha. Absolutely fantastic. You know, so do yourself a favour. Life's too short not to own a Yellowfin with a Yamaha. Call the team at Brisbane Yamaha and come on a test and buy yourself a Yellowfin with a Yamaha and put some fun back in your family. See you on the water!